Hello, welcome to the latest Chelsea news and Chelsea transfer news in just a five minute video. Let's get cracking. First up, reported everywhere and here on kickoff, Chelsea have put six players up for sale. Frank Lampard has been given the go-ahead to sell them this summer. And those six players are Jimmy Bakayoko, Emerson Palmieri, David Zappacosta, Danny Drinkwater, Michi Batshuayi and Victor Moses. We're all sitting here waiting for the Timo Werner signing to be completed and to be done and dusted. But Jamie Carragher has been talking and he's sending a message to Liverpool Man City by making huge Chelsea title claim. He believes that Chelsea are producing a squad that could challenge for the title next season. He said this, I think Chelsea were another team who the break came at a really good time for them. It was almost like a reset and look back at what they've done. The first half of the season was really good. The second half, not so good. They've had difficulties in the Champions League as well with the Bayern Munich result. I think Frank Lampard has had a good season all in considering it's his first season. It's possibly on a knife edge. If they drop out the top four or miss out in the Champions League, then people will say it's not been a good season. If they don't, people will say it's a great season. But I think the break would have come at a good time. And as I say, I think it would give Frank the chance to really look back at the season, what they've done right, what they've done well, almost get a level head, even the coaching staff as well. Make a good start and if Chelsea get going in the first two or three fixtures then they could make themselves a gap to give them the confidence to finish off the job. But it does feel like this season's on a knife edge. I also think that with Frank Lampard flexing his muscles in January and letting it be known that he wasn't happy with transfer business, Chelsea are now moving out of their way now to provide him with a squad that can do more than just challenge for the top four and maybe the title next season. Update on the Champions League and the Champions League is confirmed that once the remaining second legs of the games have been completed, there will be a 12-day knockout tournament of the quarterfinals, the semi-finals and the final over in Lisbon. As yet, it's not confirmed as to what Chelsea's second leg, where that will be, if it will be in Munich or at a neutral venue, but we just have to wait and see. With three down against Bayern, anything can happen. But if Chelsea do make a sensational comeback, we'll be off to Lisbon for a group tournament in August. With Jorginho, Juve links are still not going away. And this time, there's reports that Chelsea will be offered two players for Jorginho and Marcus Alonso. Chelsea is set to be offered Adrian Rabiot and Fernando Bernadeschi as potential double swap for Jorginho and Marcus Alonso. We all know that Jorginho has been linked with Juve. Alonso is now coming under scrutiny for being linked with a move away from Chelsea with the likes of Newcastle and Atletico Madrid also interested in Alonso. What would you do? Would you take those two for those two? I wouldn't. I think Alonso is a mainstay here and he gives Frank Lampard the option to play a wing back in a back three formation. And the fact that Emerson Palmieri is up for sale indicates that Frank wants Alonso to stay. As for Jorginho, your guess is as good as mine. And more on Alonso here. Look, Atletico Madrid to swoop for out of favour Chelsea man with just a 12 million euro bid. It's an absolute joke. It's been reported on Team Talk. It's not going to happen. Alonso will stay at Chelsea. Here's an update with Kai Havertz. He is set to snub Man United and Chelsea because he wants a dream move to Real Madrid. But it's believed that Real Madrid are not interested at this stage in signing him. What's Havertz going to do? Will he stay at Bayer Leverkusen for another season to try and impress to get his dream move to Madrid? Or will he settle for London or Manchester? Have to wait and see. More bad news reported and the fact that Chelsea and Man City target Ben Chilwell who's worth more than 50 million, which is what both clubs are willing to pay. And Leicester believe, well, in fact, they're confident that he's going to stay at Leicester this summer. Who would be the second option? Nicolas Tagliafico? So, guys, the Premier League is back and it's due to kick off very shortly with Aston Villa taking on Sheffield United, followed by Man City and Arsenal later on this evening. Then there's two more games on Friday and then we play on Sunday. We're playing Aston Villa away. Be interesting to see what happens with Villa tonight and how they approach their game against Sheffield United and of course how they get on because they are fighting for survival. Just be interesting to see what happens tonight and in the coming days. It's Wednesday the 17th of June and this has been the Chelsea News and Transfer News. 
in a five minute video. Let me know what you think about anything discussed in the video in the comments section below. Smash the like button for me and then subscribe to the channel. But make sure you hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss my videos come out. Also check more content listed here for more from my channel. Thank you for your support and for watching. See you tomorrow.